Hello and welcome back my beautiful froggy army to another vlog. I literally just finished filming my office organizing video if you watch that. I think that's getting posted before this so if you're wondering why I'm literally in the exact same hoodie that's why I just finished filming that today. In the spirit of keeping that organizational train going and just getting totally refreshed and ready for the new year I'm going through my Christmas presents and I'm gonna put everything away and since I'm gonna put everything away I might as well give you a haul besties. I don't know I I really like seeing what people get for Christmas and seeing what like oh what do your family and friends get you like it's kind of interesting to me so I thought I would do it I think I did it last year so if you're interested keep watching if not feel free to skip ahead let's get into the presents I'm so excited to show you because I feel like I got some good stuff this year so I am so grateful to my family and my friends for getting me some amazing amazing gifts one of my sisters gave me this really adorable jewelry holder and she personalized it with our names and our I think it's birth month flower but it's so cute you open it up and it's got all the stuff to put your jewelry in so adorable and my jewelry is a mess everywhere so that is definitely very useful and then another one of my sisters got me this really cute mushroom earring holder and she gave me some little kitty earrings on there they match my tattoo that i have on the back of my shoulder oh and she gave me these earrings that i'm wearing right now they're like little stars they match a little star choker that i'm always wearing so that was so thoughtful of her my mom got me this really pretty really nice Victoria's Secret body wash set and it's coconut milk and rose. I've been loving coconut scented stuff and the bag it comes in is so cute. I love that. She also got me this raw sugar body wash, pineapple and maki mac berry. I don't know how to say that and coconut. I'm very excited about that. I love having just like a little collection of body wash. Peach is also going nuts in this bag because <laughs> there's some stuff in here for her. I think she smells it. It must have catnip or something. I also got a lot of Care Bear stuff this year my mom got me these cute little Care Bear crayons and they're scented I forget oh yeah they just smell really nice I don't know what it is but it's like almost florally it's really nice and little Care Bear pens absolutely love that and a Care Bear's makeup palette look at this and I specifically have been wanting an eyeshadow palette with green eyeshadow because I don't have any green eyeshadow and it's got some right there oh I can't keep this open but yeah, super cute. I'm so excited to try that out. My boyfriend's mom got me this really, really adorable, gorgeous Disney 100 mini necklace. And it comes with the little matching earrings and also a little matching ring if you can see that it's so cute i love it absolutely adorable and then speaking of boyfriend quack this year got me this adorable frog purse look at that and it's got like the long strap and at the top it's got like this little like b i don't know what that is little b metal thing detail isn't that so cute i love the shape of this too it's super unique and he knows that i love kirby figures so he got me like the full set of these like little Kirby I don't even know what you call them they're just like little mini figures I guess but they're so adorable I am so excited to open these and the best thing he got me was tickets to the Stardew Valley tour he could have gotten me just that I would have been ecstatic like that's all I need quick intermission for two things that I actually bought on my own because we went to the mall like a few days after Christmas and uh, there was a mini so and I couldn't help myself, okay. I got this cinema roll journal planner thingy. Um, it's really cute. I could not resist, absolutely, with this little like fruit theme that it's got going on. Hopefully that's in focus. I got this matching cinema roll, just like a little storage container. Um, I always need storage. I absolutely always need storage. Okay, I think my microphone charged enough that I can put it on my actual clothes because I need to charge my camera because it's almost dead. But let's move on. My mom got me this adorable Care Bear sweater and I can't wait to wear this, especially because I've been wearing sweaters all the time because it's freezing it's like 60 degrees it's freezing <laughs> i forget who got me this i think it was my brother but it's a little hello kitty cup a little hello kitty glass i'm so so excited for that and my brother got me these whale crackers these are my absolute favorite like little snack thingy like goldfish chip type of thing then my grandma got me this really cute little froggy blanket i love it i always need blankets like i'm always using them all the time and this little froggy warmable snuggle pillow which is so adorable and i always love stuff like this especially like when i have cramps and i'm like sore and stuff like that and my grandma got me this really cute flower pillow which right now i am putting 
on my chair in this room that is perfect for my desk and she got me a little squishmallow a little squirrel squishmallow so this one is very extra special because it is from my grandma oh my goodness and i think i didn't even see this on actual christmas but she also got me this little kitty light which literally looks like my tattoo kind of and she got me some little shower gel and hand cream it's super cute and always love that stuff so my grandma got me a squishmallow and the only other squishmallow that i got for christmas was from my friend mary it is him it's him this is philippe if you don't know this has been like my most wanted number one squishmallow for for like years and he's like kind of rare a little bit expensive kind of hard to find so Mary really came through thank you Mary I love him so much I need to find a good spot for him up on the froggy shelf and then I think it was one of my sisters that got me this little fruit loops cup and cereal straws I was addicted to these cereal straws like back in the day I didn't even know that they still existed I only started seeing them recently but I'm so excited to devour those and my sister got me these little my melody nails i'm literally obsessed i'm so obsessed these are so good i got this little clinique like set what the heck this is so nice i'm so excited for this and my sister also got me a treehouse scrub the coco colada one which funnily enough i was telling her i literally just finished this one and i was like oh now i have to go buy another one but no, I don't. I, I got it for Christmas. And again, from my sister, I got these little Kermie earrings. Look at them. Look at them. They are so cute. I cannot wait to wear these. I love that they have the little rainbows. Oh, so precious. And then I think the last thing also from one of my sisters is this incredible, incredible, incredible Care Bear lounge fly oh my goodness so now i have a care bear lounge fly purse and the backpack i am so excited for this like look it even has a little design on the back like it is so cute that's what i got everything was incredible amazing and family slash friends if you're watching this and gave me any of this thank you and i love you thank you yeah i think i'm gonna go ahead and put all of this away it's pretty late tonight so i think i just wanted to record this little segment tonight before i went to sleep but i'll see you at some point it is january 1st happy new year and something that i'm doing today before i stream is just kind of trying to wrangle up my content for this month my goal for this year is just to post like more on youtube but i definitely want to try to post at least for january like every day whether that be a stream on monday and then tuesday i post a video and then wednesday i post a short and then thursday i post a video friday's another short saturday's a video something like that where i'm posting some sort of content every single day of the month the year whatever i don't think i can keep this up for an entire year but hey we could try for the first month while i'm feeling extra motivated i still have to do my hair and makeup so i'll check back in once i'm gonna do that but i'm very excited to use this care bears eyeshadow palette oh i'm so so excited for it here are the shades that are in here i think i want to try a green look because i haven't done green eyeshadow because i haven't owned any until this palette just finished up my makeup and i only have a few minutes before i'm about to hit start stream so i'm very excited to stream kicking off the new year with a villager hunting stream i'm looking for lily again and hopefully i find her maybe it'll be quick maybe it won't be i don't really know but we'll see i wanted to show you something very important very 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 important miss peach on my carpet right now She's so cute. Okay, I finished my stream and I finished dinner. We just had some like little like roast beef sandwich things. It was pretty good, but I'm gonna do a quick tidy in my room and then I'm gonna edit and then I don't know what I'm doing after that. Okay, I just finished editing and sorry, my microphone is dead. I just tried to turn it on and it's totally dead. So I need to charge that. So sorry, no mic for a second, but I'm just gonna get myself a little snacky snack. I'm gonna do some cherry ice cream and I was really specifically craving a banana split. So I kind of want that like banana flavor in here. So we're gonna do a banana 
and some chocolate syrup and that's gonna be my little dessert slash snack for the night here's my little ice cream i tried to make it banana splitty and i'm trying to use some of my halloween sprinkles that i still have i have so many so there we go i will enjoy this very much hello besties it is the next morning i just woke up a little bit ago but i'm deciding to tackle the plushy pile of all the stuff that i want to sell on my whatnot this is from my office organizing video and probably by the time you watch this all of this will probably be sold already i'm not sure but i just wanted to take you through the process that i'm going through so we'll start with this squishmallow so first i'm holding her up to the wall and taking pictures and i have to do this when i put my camera down because i can't hold both at once <laughs> okay but there we go here's on the one app i took the two pictures and then i do complete and then i just select the squishmallow category and then i type whatever i want to title it i'm just calling it seven inch pink hello kitty squishmallow and then in the description i'm going to put that it has the tags because it does and i do next and then we do the price i'm just going to do five dollars and then i've been weighing uh, other ones that are very similar in size so i know the shipping profile turn off offers and there we go we publish wait for it to load and there we go it's up on my page now i have to do that with all of these yeah so i'm gonna be here a while but i have to do this before i can post my office organizing video because i want this to be ready to go once it posts so yeah that's what i'm gonna be doing for this foreseeable future today Alrighty, most of the day is already over honestly um i worked on that whatnot stuff all day and i'm still working on it we also went and played uh some card games so that took a couple hours but now i am packing up a bunch of the orders that i got so thank you so much if you bought something off of my whatnot all of it went pretty fast so sorry about that but thank you to the people who did manage to get something so right now i am packing up this little slug and i also got a keychain bundle from me with this little doggy and a little maggie as well so i'm gonna pack these up as nicely as i can right now i'm using this box that's in here uh just as like a little mini table but <laughs> i've got the packing slip here so i'm just gonna ride a quick thank you little star there we go and then we put this inside this little shipping mailer just like that fits pretty nicely honestly eight inch squishmallows fit in here almost perfectly and then let me not expose anyone's addresses or anything we stick that in there as well and i think it's pretty good we'll take off the tape thingy and then i just fold this over nice and tight and it's nice and packed up and ready to go. So I'm probably going to be working on this for the rest of the night. Hopefully tomorrow I will pick back up again and we'll do some other stuff. So see you. Good night for now. So it's been a couple days. Hey, I'm just getting ready for the day. I need to record some videos today. I need to do at least two. So that's what we're kind of doing. I've had like the worst past three days. Like I've had this headache that has just keep coming back like it's not constant but like for the past three days i've had this headache that's around for like a few hours and then maybe it'll go away like after i go to sleep like i had it for the majority of yesterday and then it went away around the nighttime and then i went to sleep i woke up i was fine and now i have it again and then on top of that i've been nauseous for two of those days and like severely nauseous to the point where like i can't even eat anything yesterday was really bad all i had was like one pack of ramen and like half a sleeve of crackers because like that's all i could eat so i don't really know what's going on today i feel okay today i ate uh, breakfast slash lunch so that was fine the nausea hasn't been around today thank goodness it's just the headache now which I feel like I prefer over the nausea, honestly, but hopefully today the headache just maybe goes away on its own. I don't know if it will. Like, I take painkillers. I took Excedrin. Ooh. Anyways, I took Excedrin and like I still kind of had the headache. Like it did not make it fully go away. It was still kind of there. Not as strong, but it was like like underneath the painkillers it was still there i was like what the heck it was like extra strength excedrin i'm like what else am i supposed to do if excedrin doesn't help it i'm gonna use this la colors lip duo for my lips today i've kind of been using this a little bit i like it because it's the actual bullet lipstick and then it also has 
a, I think this is like a gloss. I don't know. It's got some other thing here. The only thing is I feel like this is slightly like patchy. I don't know. Could just be me though. Could be because I just put on chapstick, but <laughs> I do that with other lipsticks and they're fine. I think that's my makeup done. Uh, I just need to go do my hair. Obviously that's a little bit of a mess. So we'll go work on that and then I'm just gonna record videos, but I just wanted to talk about this ridiculous like headache and nausea that i've been feeling i don't know it's just i i never really experienced stuff like that so i'm like well, why am i getting this all of a sudden i'm literally not even doing anything or maybe that is the issue that i'm not even doing anything i don't know okay went and brushed out my hair that feels much better i would love to put it up or do a cute style with it but like i don't want to further my headache anymore and like i you know i don't want to have it like pulled tight on my scalp with like a ponytail or something so but anyways gonna turn on my lights gonna get ready to film now my desk is a mess so i'm gonna quickly tidy this up get to filming and get to editing because i have to submit a video today i just finished recording and editing and that video is exporting now and look who's with me he really wants to be fed once it hits like five o'clock oh it's 4 40 um he starts being like okay it's time to feed me even though we always feed him after dinner we feed both of them after dinner and we start eating or i start cooking at six so we usually are sitting down to eat around like 6 37 depending on how long it takes me like to cook so you don't eat until like 7 20 7 30 sir so I don't know why he's here at 4.40 asking me for food. But speaking of food, I do have to go get a snack in a second because this headache has not gone away. And I'm thinking like maybe, well, I'm not thinking. My boyfriend is telling me you're malnourished. So maybe that's why. <laughs> to be honest, he's probably right. Because I mean, like I said earlier yesterday, all I ate was ramen and crackers. Not really any nutrition there. Although I did have three eggs with my ramen. So I did have some protein, but like no vegetables or anything. So, but I wanted to show you a crochet project I've been working on because I know that you guys really like to see my crafting. This is going to be a sweater for my Build-A-Bears and I'm just using up this bright orange yarn because um, like I'm trying to make like a template right now. I'm trying to figure out the pattern. So I'm just using up this yarn because it's kind of ugly. I don't really like it. So that's what I'm doing. I'm actually writing down a pattern. Look at that. It's been a hot minute. Um, I used to write down all my patterns that I would make up and I have not done that in a long time but yeah that's what I'm working on so I'll probably work on that more tonight here's my snack I've got some crackers with some sliced cheese that I just tore into pieces and a meat stick <laughs> it's not a slim gym but yeah it's a, it's a slim gym so I'm gonna have this at least this will be some protein and delicious cheese i think i'm really missing fruits and vegetables so i'm actually gonna eat this and then go get groceries because i was like i want a fruit or veggie and we just didn't have any i'm going in here in literally the worst possible time to go it's 5 30. what am i doing going to the grocery store at 5 30 it's gonna be so packed but whatever i need to get stuff to make dinner anyways because i don't really have anything to make but i had to put my hair up because it's just bothering me and i just don't want to deal with it but yeah i guess we'll get on in there it's been a little bit i have just been working on packing up all the whatnot orders just trying to cover some addresses that are sitting there but yeah that whole pile is a bunch of orders and i'm gonna have a little snack some of this yogurt drink and a protein bar just trying to be a little healthy i was watching tiktoks on here don't mind me and i'm about to play lethal company we have a whole group going so i'm gonna do that for a little bit if i'm smart i'll still record a video tonight so we'll see how my energy is i've still had my headache all day it's definitely not as bad as it was it's just like kind of 
there. Like, it doesn't bother me too much, but it's definitely there. I definitely notice it if I pay attention. Thankfully, I was not nauseous today and I was able to eat normally. Um, so that's really good because I did not want to keep just not being able to eat because I was so nauseous. Late night Wawa run. We're looking for snacks. I don't know what I want. I kind of already had a snack, so I don't know if I'm going to get anything. I'm recording you. Why? They don't have like any of the cookies. They do. It's over here. Chalky milk. I'm gonna get this. Panquecitos. So cute. I decided. Panquecito. You got this. What else you got? Banana muffin. Banana muffin. Wow. I don't know what the fuck is. Okay. Got it. It's the next day. It's already 10.30 p.m. Today was kind of a day. Um, I overslept like a lot today. Like I am not an early riser by any means and people always say like, oh yeah, Raven always wakes up at noon, blah, blah, blah. And sometimes I do, okay? Sometimes I do. But lately I've just been getting up around like 11. Like usually I'm out of bed by 12 at the absolute latest. Today I slept until 1.30 p.m. and like I didn't even go to bed like super late like there will be some days where i go to bed at like 4 or 5 a.m but i still get out of bed by noon at the latest so i don't know what happened today my boyfriend was like yeah i tried waking you up at noon and you were like yeah i'll wake up and then i went back and you were asleep and i'm like i don't even remember that like i don't even remember waking up at noon so I don't know but since i woke up so late i did not have time to do anything this morning because we actually had plans with friends so we had to just go like very soon after i woke up so i had to post a video today i didn't even get to finish editing it i posted a short today instead whatever it's fine but we hung out with some of our friends who were in town and it was really fun we went to an arcade and we did some fun arcade stuff you know sometimes it's just fun to do those sorts of things i did a few claw machines and did not win anything actually quack did win me something he won me a little mini brands uh capsule out of one of them very very cute and then we went and we did like hibachi and that was really fun i haven't been to hibachi in a couple of years a lot of years probably um so that was really fun and i'm so full from that but that was my only meal today because i woke up so late i didn't eat lunch i didn't eat anything until hibachi actually i'm editing that video now that i had to edit today i'll probably work on my crocheting later that i was showing you earlier and uh yeah i'll probably check in once i'm doing that just wanted to check in tell you about my day put in those few clips that i had and uh yeah i'll see you later for crocheting if i get around to that it's the next day and i'm just out running some errands really quickly today we do have dinner later tonight so i gotta be back at a certain time so we're a little bit pressed for time and i'm trying to get a lot of things done but i think we can manage to do it come along with me today we are running errands let's head into cvs for our first one okay we're here i'm looking for the valentine's day hello kitty pajama pants but i don't see them all i see are some of the slippers i think i missed them can i be real with you guys i do not like these squishmallows like i like the little hearts on the cinnamon roll but why did they have to put this chocolate stuff on there i i don't like it they do have a little fuzzy journal but again it's like all chocolate i, I i'm not a fan i'm not a fan of this branding this year i'm grabbing two boxes of cereal because they're on a good deal they're only two dollars as you can see right there um but what are these regular cereal prices what is that what is this i mean i know it's cbs it's expensive but oh my goodness <laughs> okay back in the car i got my cereal that was really just a bonus like a fun little thing to pick up um the main thing i was going in there for was a pickup order i got this l'oreal magic bb cream i've tried this before in a different shade and it did not work for me like it was way too orange so i'm trying this like anti-redness shade it's also so dreary look at this very sad i love these cups but do i need them not at all not at all i'm in a dangerous aisle valentine's day stuff these are so cute <gasps> the strawberry and chocolate oh my goodness okay they've got like little ceramic figures we've got the birds of course i mean i i need these right strawberry yeah 
Yeah, I need these. I bought this last year or the year before and I have not used it a single time. <laughs> I love their little seasonal like um, glass containers here. There was one for spring that was so cute that I bought, but I either broke it or something happened to it and I'm so sad and I haven't seen it again. Snoopy kisses? Are you actually kidding me? Strawberry? I think I'm getting these. Look at these. They're little tiny Funko Pops. I think I'm gonna get some of these for my boyfriend. He would love these. I probably should have gotten a basket. Uh, I see one. I'm gonna grab one. We are in TJ Maxx and I think I see the cat baskets. Just kidding, I don't. I don't. Does anyone need napkins for $3.50? Come to TJ Maxx. And these are the cutest little teapots. Look at that. Oh my goodness, these are so precious. Look at this one. It's like a little flower on a leaf plate with this little butterfly spoon. Are you kidding? Hello Kitty mug spotted. My Melody mug. This one's actually really cute. I do not need mugs. Do not let me buy one. I like this. There's more. I love all this pink glass. Look at this like vase. These cups. I have no idea what this mushroom is, but I love it. So cute. I did come looking for Hello Kitty Valentine's Day plates, but these were not it. This is not what I'm looking for. Look at these hand soaps. Oh my goodness. I love these little makeup brushes. So cute. I love your purse. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Looking for heart-shaped purses. Here's one, but I don't really like that. I do like this little fruit pattern, really cute. Heart-shaped pasta, don't tempt me, don't tempt me. I do like whatever mushroom thing this is. These are kind of freaky, like is it just me? I don't like those. <laughs> mushroom lamp, oh my goodness. These mushroom little containers. I literally just bought containers at Aldi. I don't need them. Uh. As much as I want those mushroom containers, I think I'm not gonna get anything. There's nothing that I really need or like really, really want. Just stuff that's like, oh, cute. And, like that's it, so I think I'm gonna leave. Hey, I'm back home now. We had dinner, we played our little card games and everything, and I got a little black and white smoothie milkshake, milkshake from Wawa, so I've been drinking that. I had this milkshake sitting on the counter, okay? And it had whipped cream on top. I had that on the counter in the kitchen and I was just like putting stuff away from everything I bought earlier and Pepper's in the kitchen. Next thing I know, I turn around and Sir Pepper is licking the whipped cream from my milkshake. He only got a few licks in, but I was like, come on. Like I hadn't even drank any of it yet. And this man is here stealing my whipped cream from my milkshake. <laughs> so uh, yeah, he has been really mischievous lately. He was licking cheese on New Year's. He's licking my uh, whipped cream from my milkshake. What's he gonna get into next? I don't know. Um, I'm transferring some footage on my computer right now. It is almost done and I'm going to work a little bit on my crochet project and then I'm going to be editing for the rest of the night. I am also using uh, Sir Cinema Roll Build-A-Bear as my little test subject for this little thing that I'm doing for them. So yeah, I'm gonna work on that. I'll check in in just a sec. I am almost done with this. So I made a prototype of this and it did not come out very well. So this is version two of the little sweater. I just need to do the other sleeve. And then the only thing is the back. I did not make this like long enough. So I'm gonna have to add some width here, but yeah, it's coming out so good. Again, I think I said it earlier, but I just want like, a blank like you know general pattern to make any sort of little top for them so very excited it is the next day and i finished the sweater i think it came out really really cute i love it i was also testing it on miss kitty that's why she's here 
because on the back cinema roll does have the whole tail situation which makes it a little bit more difficult but i think i figured it out so i added some length on the back and what i could do is add a button at the top here and just have it be buttoned like that and just have this be open but i think with any other build-a-bear this will actually close if i added some buttons so i think i may do that but again since cinema roll has this tail that adds extra bulk this was probably not the best one to test it on. I should probably get my frogs. But they were sitting there so nicely and I don't wanna mess with them right now. So worst case scenario, I just add one button at the top, you know? So yeah, there it is. That's how it came out. Again, this is just a pattern. I was just working out the kinks because I want to make a sweater or an outfit for each of my froggy Build-A-Bears and maybe Miss Kitty and Cinema Roll. And I just wanna have the pattern down so that I don't have to wing it every single time and guess every single time how to make it and the dimensions and stuff. So there we go. But I think I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up the vlog here. So thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed everything. And uh, don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and check out my social media and cameo okay thank you thank you so much again for watching and i will see you in the next one